show on television where we combine a dying family's estate and divide it between distant relatives and complete strangers using a series of fun party games. Wait a minute, yep. you told me this was Jeopardy! Huh. <laughs> well as the people of your generation would put it, we lied! Oh, Alright, <laughs> America, say hello to dying Aunt Polly. <laughs> young man! <laughs> young man! Yeah. Young them! Mm -hmm. Am I... am I dying? Well, you know, uh, 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 Pauline, in some ways you're already dead. Oh, shit! <laughs> That's right, Harrison. Before the show, our in-house doctors diagnosed dying Aunt Polly with mega cancer. <laughs> You'll be no, dead please. in a month. We're really gonna miss you, dying Aunt Polly. Thank Truly. you very much. Yes. All right, now let's get to the motherfucking game. Yeah, I want that old bag's car. Yeah. Fuck you. Right, now that over there is Vinny, dying Aunt Polly's second cousin, and he'll be playing with... Taylor, her nurse, as well as Marsha, her niece. <laughs> For the first game, we have Vinny. He has to eat one Oreo in under a minute, but the twist, he can't use his hands, and the Oreo starts on his forehead. Wait, wait a minute, you also told me that this was Jeopardy. Yeah. Right, it, it's not. Okay, oh, so yeah. now let's go ahead and spin the Wheel of Materialism to see what Vinny will be playing for. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh, 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 o
Asian Homer Marsha. Oh! And you know, you know what? I can't. You know what's gonna happen? Fuck off. You know what's gonna happen to that old antique furniture? Going straight to hell. I'm burning that shit. days on this planet in the luxury of a Best Western motel, courtesy of Expedia. Thank your corporate sponsors, everyone. It's not even Marriott. All right, <laughs> that's it. I've had enough of this stupid game. What you're doing here is disgusting. It's barbarian. It's evil. Now, come on, Danya. I mean, regular Polly. Let's go home. Uh, are you I mean, sure? let's go to your motel. Are you sure? Um, yes, I'm sure. She's sure. Well, it's just, there's still a lot of prizes if you'd like to spin. No, there's not. I mean, well, we're leaving anyways, so <laughs> what's the harm of spinning, right? Mm -hmm. So much harm. <laughs> You know, mm, it, it's a shame you're quitting because if you had just eaten a pie without your hands, then you could have won all three hundred thousand dollars left in Diane and Molly's inheritance. Twenty, twenty-five years. Twenty-five years. <laughs> Move aside, you worthless bag of what? lunch. Oh, my back. <laughs> my hips and my back. <laughs> Congratulations! Fuck you! Yeah. My knees! Mm -hmm. all, all the money that was meant for dying in Polly's children will now go straight to you! Now, there's many more prizes left. Would you like to continue? Um, yes! Please. This woman needs to be in the graveyard like yesterday! What? I never! Shut the fuck up, you old bitch! <laughs> Silly goose. It means you get dying in Polly's cancer. Fuck you. I don't think that's how science works. <laughs> Ow, you bitch! Right. Just hey! Bless you. <coughs> that's. <coughs> Take that, you skinny skinny bitch! That's what you get for spending all my social security checks on your baby ills. <laughs> now, not so fast, newly regular Aunt Polly. Oh, you my... two will be dead in three days from a freak muffin accident. Oh, 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 oh what? <laughs> well, that's our show, folks. Uh, tune in next week when five teenagers compete for the wish of a dying Make-A-Wish kid. <laughs> <laughs>